Good morning, gamers. This is Mark with your Ohio Hammer R&R for the week ending July 22nd, 2012. Start things off, Anvil Industries has put out four kits of bionic accessories for their Steam Knight figures. Included is a sprue of five bionic heads for two and a quarter pounds. Five different pairs of bionic rifle arms for three and a half pounds. A little more ornate looking uh, large bionic arm with a power claw for 380 in pounds. Also a torso with arm for 165. So be sure to check those out if you're doing like a... Uh, an Iron Hands themed Space Marine Army. This might be really good for uh, diversifying those squads a little bit. Now our friends over at Hawk War Games have put out the cover for the rulebook for Drop Zone Commander. And remember guys, the pre-orders for Drop Zone Commander should be uh, in the mail tomorrow. So if you've... Uh, Gotten in on that? Be sure to look for that coming soon. Moving on into Dust Warfare from Fantasy Flight Games. They've been kind of busy this time with the SSU, giving us both an uh, anti-tank unit and a command unit. And these are five figures for 1995, I believe, as well as the uh, heavy tanks. And these will be the usual uh, two in a box for $39.95. Cromlech has went ahead and released its series of weathering powders. Now you can get all ten weathering powders for $35.99. Or you can buy individuals for $3.99. And these come in such colors as soot black, red rust, brick dust, dark dirt, concrete gray, dark sand. So pretty much your usual beginning range of weathering powder. So be sure to take a look at Cromlech for these. Our friends over at Puppets War have released a line of demonic axes. And these are just plain axes, guys. There is no hand attached to them. But you get six different demonic axes. And they fit with 28 millimeter models for uh, for seven euros, and there are six individual sculpts. And guys, the last thing I have for you this week is six previews from Cool Mini or Not's latest Wrath of Kings game. If you recall, Wrath of Kings will be debuting at uh, Gen Con this year. So we will be more than likely seeing quite a bit more from them coming up in the next two or three weeks. So guys, it's been a relatively short week this time. I'm sure I missed one or two items in the hubbub. But this is Mark, and I will see you next week. This podcast was brought to you by the Ohio Hammer Network of Podcasts. If you like the show, please check out our site, www.ohiohammer.com, and follow us on Twitter. Our addresses are at OhioHammer2011, at Jake underscore OhioHammer, at Mark Dieter, and at Ken underscore Second Founding. We ask that if you like the show, please leave us a positive review on iTunes. Remember... All products and companies talked about on this podcast are the respective property of their owners, and the Ohio Hammer Network makes no claim to said property. As always, guys, enjoy the site, enjoy the podcast, and enjoy the game.